Hey guys, this is Isabel from helpandalitter.org and I'm here at world famous painter Wyland's house and I'm about to interview him for the first time. Hey guys, it's Isabella from helpandalitter.org and I'm here today with Wyland. Thank you so much for this opportunity. It really is great to be able to interview you. Thank you, Isabella, and uh, it's an honor to do this with you. And it's great to see our, our youth ambassadors like yourself out there uh, taking action to ensure that we uh, keep the pollution out of our beautiful waterways. Good job. Thank you so much. Sure. Okay, so to start off, um, how many murals have you done? I did a hundred official um, ocean murals, the whaling walls, but I've done thousands of murals in, in all 50 states and a hundred countries mm -hmm. around the world. I, I like painting murals with uh, with kids too, and uh, that's that's what I continue to, to do now that I've painted my last and final wall in Beijing uh, for the uh, Green Olympics there in uh, 2008. Do you have a favorite wall you painted? Well, you know, they're all like my kids, you know, all 100 walls. The first one was really, you know, kind of sacred, and then uh, I painted one in Long Beach, California. That was in the Guinness Book World Records, largest mural ever painted, and I actually just painted one larger uh, in Destin, Florida. So, yeah, I like to paint big, but, you know, my subjects are big. All right, so what got, like, how old were you when you realized that you wanted to become a painter? And how old are you? Today? I'm 14. Yep. Right around there, about 14, I went to California, I saw the ocean for the first time, had dreamt about it my whole life and decided that uh, that's what I wanted to do. But I was really fortunate too, I was an artist in the right place at the right time because back then, it was like 1971, uh, the first Earth Day, Greenpeace, you know, save the planet, and I happened to see a, a whale on mm -hmm. that uh, first day that I saw the ocean, I saw a whale spout right in front of me mm -hmm. kind of changed my life so I was your age when I started uh, you know my real environmental art and uh, you know I've been a serious artist ever since yeah it's just like how I'm starting help and all litter now around my age today cool. so I hear you have a Florida license plate can you tell me a little bit about that yes I have the Florida license plate the Wyland official license plate for uh, save the whales and uh, protect uh, our ocean so it's really cool it's the whale tail it's blue I like blue <laughs> so uh, yeah if you get a Florida license plate uh, that goes to our uh, programs and initiatives to conserve not only whales but the, the health of the ocean cool okay well thank you so much for this opportunity this was really great to be interviewing you after wanting to for so long hey all right happy to do it all right Isabella everybody and everybody out there thank you for joining her it's really going to take all of us to uh, make the kind of difference that we need to ensure a healthy planet. Thank you so much. Good job. Bam.